Hey guys, Nazish Munid is here with another exciting video. Today we are looking at our guide review on the top world's 5 best GPUs for mining in 2022 provided in the marketplace. Yes. Using the best GPU for mining is not as easy as picking the most expensive card. You can look at and calling it a day. If you don't have to spend much on choosing the best of best GPU for mining 2022, please don't skip this video. If you are coming for the first time on our channel, then please like, share, comment and subscribe to the channel. We made this list based on our personal opinion and research based on their quality, features durability price and much more if you choose from my you can list be satisfied that you are buying the best GPU for money please do check the product link in the description below so friends let's get started number five on my list is MSI gaming Radeon the essential characteristic of a mining card is it's time for user to get it back. This MSI Gaming Radeon has a storage capacity ranging from 4 to 8 GB and frequency of 11 to 70 MHz and this card pays for itself in around 4 months taking into account for the electricity bill as for the main parameters and this graphic card is almost no worse than the RX480 model and during the boom it became an utterly rational analog for users who did not have time or could not buy the RX480 model for their own needs. There is also a good aftermarket for the RX470 graphics card and difficulties with the core overheating during regular loading are rare but performance of this graphics card has long had an impossible repetition. So, when you buy a Radeon RX470 model, you won't regret. It gives 30 hashes and it consumes 50 to 70 watts less energy. The costs are many times cheaper, even it have one year warranty. It comes with many high-end features as it has a cheapest and Radeon RX480 E1. This is made with video memory, 4GB, GDDR5. It also shows maximum resolution, sports, display, monitors, but it has such display port, 500 watt system, power supply. So friends, number 4 on my list is Avega G4. That is a regular contributor to various top mining cards. And this review is no exception. The hash rate ratios are worse than top in graphics cards, but the lower price compared to two premium cards bring the same return. The company has developed this NVIDIA external GPU for games. Still, the cryptocurrency miners quickly found a place for it because of its excellent performance and lower power consumption. This card is a great solution for high-end mining. Among the board's advantage is the limiting hash rate. Among the minuses in the reviews, they know the high cost. The coefficients of the graphics card fully meets the requirements for mining. You can easily mine digital queens. Even, with, even the GPU GPON 102 high speed gddr 5 x memory the required power supply is 600 watt while the temperature limit is 84 degrees according to the test results the hash should fluctuates around MH slash and overlocking increased its ratio by 12 made with a nice design and amazing function besides this it has an excellent build quality and this increases the stability of the main components and an effective cooling system that can also be replaced if necessary. It also comes with many high-end features. This pre-owned product has been professionally inspected and there will be no visible cosmetic imperfections when held at arm's length. And it is available with batteries, will exceed 80 capacity and it will be compatible and fully functional. So friends, next on my list is Asus GeForce GTX 1070 Ti that has a lower parameters compared to the 1080 Ti. But it is still a good board for gaming. It can actually be safely used in mining cryptocurrencies. The main advantage of the board is excellent match between cost and quality and even better energy efficiency compared to the GTX 1080. It comes with oversized graphics card with efficient power supply and backlighting. The performance has been improved three times compared to the previous generation boards and the hash rate in the factory setting is 26.3 individual 
gradual overlocking that increases this coefficient better performance on the test. For example, an output of 31.7 mH was obtained during ether degradation and the power consumption was 110 watts. Its improved cooling increases shelf life while the fans are only activated after reaching 64 degrees and they work quietly and the recommended power supply has a power of 500 watts and the te technological characteristics are suitable for miners and also for gamers. Unfortunately, it has weak degree of hashing in the factory parameters because it consumes a lot of energy compared to the other models and its costs are very high. Even there is an overlocking potential feature and high quality cooling, excellent performance and strong build but at the same time noiseless cooler is also awesome. Next on my list is Zotax G4 GTX 1070 that cannot stand out compared to other boards in terms of payback time. It is produced with only 8 GB of memory and with the maximum speed of 28 mh or per second but all of this is probably too expensive for a car to buy it to pay off the user has to endure about 115 days. The model that has shown itself to be successful in the degradation of ether undoubtedly rightly takes sixth place in this evolution. Moreover, the Pascal architecture which is typical of all G410 video cards and offers the possibility to achieve three times better results make the card almost incapable to and competitors. Besides this, it is essential to note that this technical solution is the most widespread among digital coin miners worldwide. Therefore, the user has to pay a considerable amount for his purchase. This solution is a perfect for miners who don't want to invent a bicycle and can afford to purchase multiple such graphics cards. It is quiet and efficient cooling. This is made well with three years warranty. However, it has dual BIOS system available with stylish lightning and app and power supply. I like its high-end features because Zotax G4's 1070 uses the power supply of Pascal that is the most advanced gaming GPU on the planet. It delivers the exceptional performance, innovative new gaming technologies. It also supports direct X12 features for the fastest so friends, number one on my list is XFX Radeon RX 580 that is just as popular as NVIDIA boards because of their low cost and high end performance. The Radeon 470 and 480 disappeared from retail stores within second of the BTC rate. Spike users looking to build a productive mining farm with a normal power consumption should pay due attention on SFX RX 580. They need to take their crowds. They could have their own head. They could tell that this is wrong. They will have super VS exit exactly and it's time to but it is great, great overlocking potential that can improve the parameters of the chip and the installed high speed GDDR5 memory with a capacity of 4 GB. The Radeon RX 580 is hardly differs from the previous top contender. Also, this model technology technological characteristics are slightly better, and this is a 1 to 57 megahertz frequency overlocked to 1340 megahertz and an updated version of the Polaris 20 core that replaces the 10 Polaris, which is similar computing unit makeup. The RX 580 is a more recent graphics card, so its cost its cost is slightly higher than its predecessors. Besides this, it is an understandable and easy to software. This is adaptive energy saving under load product. The ability to use multiple planets is signed to increase the hash rate and ROI lowering the average, average temperature with activated radion. It also with it also comes with high-end features. The 580 series graphics card features the latest Polaris architecture. Equipped with XFX double dissipation cooling, multiple factory GPU and overlock setting and it delivers a virtually stutter free low latency experience. Hence that's all our guide review about the top best GPU for mine. Thanks for watching this video. 
if we help you out anyway then please like share comment and subscribe button of this channel and also remember to leave a comment to let us know your opinion we will see you guys in the next video bye